Okay guys, so the sciatic nerve glide, um, this exercise is fantastic. It's often very overlooked, but it creates a huge difference on where you can go in your flexibility in your hamstrings. It's a very basic exercise, but from little things, big things grow. And often it's the little things that are the things that we are missing to create the changes we need. So if you're one of those people that have been trying to increase their flexibility, maybe even getting some sciatic pain, this is a sciatic nerve glide, or perhaps um, you can't square off your splits, then this exercise can make an absolutely big difference in the long term when done consistently and properly. So all you're gonna need is actually one chair and making sure it's high enough so your leg can move in a bend and straight format. And from there, you're just gonna need to sit down. So take a seat with me. Okay, from here, you're going to sit up nice and tall. And then you're going to round forward, okay? From here, once you've rounded forward, you're gonna extend your foot out at the top extension here, rounding forward. And then you're going to flex your foot and look up. Then you're gonna point and curl down. One, extend and look up. Point and curl down. Two, and you're gonna keep doing this three, until you've done 15 repetitions, four on both sides. So it's nice and slow and controlled. There's no rush to the movement. And it's all about opening that sciatic nerve glide area to make a huge difference into your hamstrings to create flexibility and movement in openness without any pain and it's often so overlooked so we're rounding down here curling almost like a c-spine in pilates and then extending on up as we flex our foot lengthening out like in a long hamstring movement in yoga so we've got the two combining let's do two more one two and then once you're done one side you will do exactly the same on the other Extend out, but firstly, curl down. Abs are engaged. Belly button goes to spine. Ribs connect down into the hips. Curling down, holding onto the chair. Extending out, pointing that foot. Nice point, really rounding down. And then flexing and extending up. And then rolling back into your curve. And then flexing and coming up. And you do exactly the same amount. So 15 on one side, 50 on the other. And you repeat that every couple of days and it's going to make a huge difference. So I hope you enjoyed and I wish you an amazing day. Namaste.